Hi, it's Revision Rabbit, and today we're talking about eukaryotes and prokaryotes, so let's hop into it. So, what are eukaryotes? Eukaryotes include all animal and plant cells. They are more complex than prokaryotes, and they have a cell membrane, cytoplasm and genetic material enclosed in a nucleus. The nucleus holds DNA, which is the blueprint of life. Cytoplasm supports and contains organelles which allows them to function. And the cell membrane holds the cell together for animal cells and a cell wall supports and strengthens it for plant cells. Moving on to prokaryotes. Prokaryotes include all bacteria and archaea cells. They are smaller and simpler. And just like eukaryotes, they also have a cell membrane ribosomes and cytoplasm. However, the genetic material isn't enclosed in a nucleus. Instead, they have a singular circular strand of DNA and it just floats around in the cell. Now let's talk about the similarities. Eukaryotes and prokaryotes both have genetic material, which is another way of saying DNA. They both have ribosomes, cytoplasm and a plasma membrane which is another way of saying cell membrane. And now the differences. While eukaryotes are large and complex, prokaryotes are small and simple. Eukaryotes have a true nucleus enclosed by a nuclear envelope, but prokaryotes have DNA located in the nucleoid region. Eukaryotes contain membrane-bound organelles when prokaryotes lack membrane-bound organelles. Eukaryotes can be single-celled or multicellular, when prokaryotes can only be single-celled. The DNA of a eukaryote is organised as linear chromosome, as the DNA of a prokaryote is a single chromosome. All right, so, I hope you now understand the differences between eukaryotes and prokaryotes. Make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any more revision videos. See you in the next one. Bye.